How's it going guys? Mr. Boss for the win here and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to get in Franklin's house in Grand Theft Auto Online. It's fairly easy, only a few steps. Let's get started. Alright, so the first thing you're going to need to get is a sports car, some faster, sportier vehicle. And what you're going to do is go to the hill that is right across the street from Franklin's home. You're going to want to kind of launch yourself off this rock right here and onto the roof of his house. That's the first step. The second step is a little trickier, but it's not that bad. So what you want to do is look for that lip in the roof, the part that's extended off the side. And you kind of want to drive your vehicle at an angle on it, meaning the front of your car should hit that side of the roof. And as you do that, you want to eject out of the vehicle and if you do it correctly your body should really flounder down uh, into the home you should go through the invisible wall uh, that is on that side portion and look I am in Franklin's house right here obviously it's like a clone copy from the campaign there are a few things different and there are a few things missing uh, for example, there isn't really anything in the kitchen and uh, you obviously can't break these windows. I wasn't able to go outside or go onto the deck or in the pool. Those glass can't be broken. And uh, another thing is the TV doesn't work. I was surprised to see that uh, maybe the TV doesn't work or maybe you were able to watch some TV, but it turns out you are not able to do that. In fact, the only thing you're able to do in this apartment is look through the telescope that is near this pseudo fireplace over here. You couldn't smoke uh, weed from his bong either. So the only thing you could do was look through the telescope and I thought that was pretty funny as well. So for the longest time, I've wanted these houses in Rockford Hills uh, to be available to purchase in Grand Theft Auto Online. I figure around the price tag of a million, million five, two million dollars, something along those lines. And uh, it's really cool. So maybe the fact that we're able to kind of get into Franklin's house like this is maybe a sign that it might become available for sale one day. I mean, who knows? It's got all the accoutrements of a house in uh, Grand Theft Auto Online, like the apartments you see. You could use it for heist. Obviously, it's big enough to have a planning room. It's got a bed you can sleep in. It's got the closet. It's got the TV, the kitchen where you can keep all the stuff like drinking whiskey or, you know, drinking the wine like you can do in the apartments in this game right now. And so I do think that one day this apartment will be available, or this house, I really should say. And it's awesome because I do think this is one of the coolest houses in the game when Franklin got it in the campaign in the story mode. I was really excited. It's just a super nice mansion overlooking Los Santos, and it's in a great location. So hopefully one day it will become available in Grand Theft Auto Online. Anyways, guys, if you did like this video or found the information helpful, I would encourage you guys to leave a like on the video, push that thumbs up button, and leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think about Franklin's home in Grand Theft Auto Online. Is it something you would like to see eventually for sale one day, and would you like to live in it yourself? Other than that, guys, if you are new, I would encourage you guys to subscribe as well for more awesome daily gaming videos like this. Anyways, guys, take care. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.